Shana Tova, everyone. Happy New Year. I am coming to you from one of my favorite places, the Thornhead Preserve in the north end of Bath. Coming to wish you a Happy New Year, a sweet New Year, and to help us wake up by hearing the sound of the shofar. So I'll wait a minute while you go ahead and find your paper mache shofar that you got in your high holiday kit. Go ahead and run and get it and bring it over. You're gonna need it so we can blow shofar together. If you haven't yet had an opportunity to make the shofar, no problem. You can watch this video afterwards, make your shofar, and then come back and do the shofar calls with me again. So I brought two shofar oat out here to Thornhead with me today, this long kind of windy one show it up close and this shorter one i'm going to be using the long one today i'll put this other one down and there's three calls for the shofar Takia is one kind of medium-sized blast shivarim is three medium-sized blasts and true ah is nine very quick staccato blasts on the shofar. And then finally, Tekia Gedola is a long, one long blast. So grab your shofar. I'll do the calls uh, and we'll do them through a few times together. Tekia, one blast. And true ah, that's nine quick ones. And Takia Gadola, the long one long blast. So go ahead and listen to those through. Try it on your paper mache shofar. I want to teach you one other way to say the blast of the shofar, which is a song. It's a song written by Peter and Ellen Allard, and we'll sing it together a few times through. So I'm going to put down my shofar. This one I like to do with hand motions. I like to hear the shofar blast, sometimes slow and sometimes fast. Try that. I like to hear the shofar blast, sometimes slow and sometimes fast. Nice job. I like to hear the shofar blast, happy, happy, happy new year. Try that. I like to hear the shofar blast, happy, happy, happy new year. All right, here come the blasts. We're going to use our hands. Tequila. Try that. Tequila. Okay, Shavarim. You remember how many is Shavarim? Three. Shavarim. Try that. Shavarim. And then Trua is nine quick ones. Teru. Ah, 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 I like to hear the shofar blast, sometimes slow and sometimes fast. I like to hear the shofar blast, happy, happy, happy new year. We blow the shofar during the whole month leading up to Rosh Hashanah, during the whole month of Elul. Why do we do this? We do this because we want to wake ourselves up. So I bet when you are blowing your paper mache shofar, you are causing some noise in your household. That's the purpose of the shofar. We want to wake ourselves up so that we can think about the year that is ending and so we can think about the people that we want to be in the year to come so that we can be as awake and open as possible to being our best selves. Shana Tova, a sweet new year.